cash. Where are you? One. Push in. Give me a gosh. Where are you? Two. Push in. Give me a gosh. Where are you? So that's Kamo Kato. Fire and Kamo Kato. Um, Fu no Kato. Wind. And it's a gate on. Gate on. So, the thing Duncan really talks about with this is it's your hips and your feet that do the work. So you're in so shin. You step off and you drop this, then you rotate. Okay? So you're you're just putting your arm down. You're not doing any of this. You're just putting it here, rotating your hips. That lines up the strike. And it's a boshi. Thumb strike. So what, what you really want to work on is getting offline, putting that down, and then opening them up with the twist of the hips. That's not easy to do at all. Oh. You just did. <laughs> but you, it's interesting is when he does it, watch, when I punch, there's something that happens to me. When he goes here, when he does that, look. And that, that, puts, took my, took my. And that puts me in line for this. Now, the, the, the gate on, the low block, it's literally putting your arm down. You're not doing anything. And then move. If you try to do all the fancy, whoa, yeah. you, you misalign your own kamai. So you put it here, you twist, and you go. Mm -hmm. And it's this part of the arm. It's not the side, it's not this, it's this meaty part of the arm that absorbs the attack. Do that. Step off, drop the gate on, rotate the hips, and push it. This side. Drop. Okay. Step. Drop. Rotate. Good. One more time. Step. Drop. Rotate. Push it. Good. And you should feel like a wet noodle. And you'll see why when we do the next one, which is uh, cool. So, the funny thing about Ku is the, this hand coming up. So, Densho basically says, gate on, hand up, lure them in, and then kick. That's kind of the basic. Uh, Chris and I like to do gate on, hand up, push it forward and blind them or take away their vision, mm -hmm. follow with the kick. Mm -hmm. Well, if you watch the way the hips work, uh, it throws everything yeah, out. Yeah. Bam! See, that's the hip movement. And that lines this kick yep. straight up. And I actually can't see his knee come up. <laughs> when he does it like that, I can't see his knee come up. I see his hand, but I can't see his knee. Right? So you're in so shin, you drop, you have to flick everything up. That keeps his attention. And now your body's lined up again for that driving oh. kick. That's really what you want to feel that, oh, that wet noodle feel. Oh, bam. All right. Is it? <coughs> Ready? Step off. Gate on. Hips. And kick. Switch. So shin. Step off. Gate on. Hips. Kick. Good. One more time. Gate on. So uh, Gate on. Hips. Kick. That's the key to the entire art right there, is that movement of the hips, movement of the knees, feeling like a, a noodle, and you kind of just absorb that way. So, one thing that Duncan talks about a lot is practicing on your own. Find a mirror, make sure you're rotating the hip. Make sure you're not twisting the knees so you're ow. It's body movement. You get yourself aligned. And then hold. Yes. Right? Yes. Exactly. So now you need to watch your target. My target is off. So if you're standing here and Dan comes in, your first movement is out, out here. So if his feet are in this direction, that's fine. So once you shoot in, you're striking that hip area, that's what you're shooting into him. 
Yeah. Yeah. If you need to chase it, that's fine. Because that's putting you in a position where you're underneath you. Bang. Bang. Okay. So we're going to do it quick. Because we're looking for accuracy right now. Right? Right up, to right. up and under, you're out of the way. How much muscle does that feel? Like? I put a little too much. Mm -hmm. Okay, exactly. So do it again. <laughs> Okay, so what I'm doing is not lifting this, this arm is not going, so it's not moving the arm like you said, like, there we go, there you go, now, okay, yes. right, so how'd that feel, I feel a little better, so the, the key is, this, yes, mm -hmm. this initial, this initial strike, is important because if I just put it here, he's standing right there, he's strong. If I need to push him back because that creates the opening. Bang! That's going to knock him over. I can stop him. And then he's going. Then you're right here. Okay. This is the common error with this. Muscle, muscle, muscle. Yeah. Walk, walk. When did you feel? <laughs> That's what you want to do. That's what you want to do. A corkscrew. And once you get locked, once you get locked in that spot, boom, boom. Once you get here, now we're just gonna walk. And he'll throw himself out. You don't think you did anything. And you'll know that because you'll feel like you're floating. And you'll know that because you'll go, holy crap, the guy just flew away and I didn't do anything. That's what you do. Right? Mm -hmm. Try that. I felt like a little better, but a little muscle. Okay? Nothing wrong with muscle will start while you learn it. Too much muscle. Uh, one thing to note, you're you're a little shorter than that, so you're when you're striking, you're staying out here. Strike and you need to follow, take a little step. And you're still guarding, you're still in a good position. Because you're still leaning a little bit. So then you're striking. Oh. And then you're out here, you don't really have good leverage. So don't be afraid to move. All the time. So actually, I should move like this, I should be moving. Right? Yeah, you're, you're taking too big of a step right now. Because I'm in a guard, but even if he turns to do some kind of side cut, this is in the way. Or I could just drop that in But I'm in a pretty decent guard position. Or I can move. Right? So, and I know this is scary because it's nice. We want to be fully crap. <laughs> but we don't have to. We're still aligned to do what we need to do. Okay. There you go. Let's get it. Yeah. Okay. 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 Start again. Start again. Start again. Start again. Start again. Start again. Here. Watch this hand. You don't need to go like this. You're doing this thing where you're doing this and then you're pushing. You don't need to. What's happening is, what's going to happen to his body? The hip is going to push back. Torso's been hit. Okay? This here, watch what happens. I'm going to take my wrist and go palm up. And, not, and it's not just this. Watch my hips. Watch what my hips do. They go into that direction. They turn like that. They literally sink into it and turn. So it's not this where you're that. You're not muscling it that way. It's just here. It's just right there. Yeah. Part of it is the placement he's getting in my arm. That is good. You're, you're getting the elbow? 
and you're getting a little bit back here where the lock isn't as good. Yeah, so there's less, le there's less leverage. And you want to try to get out the elbow. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Right behind the elbow. One more time, then switch. <laughs> I was just trying to face the wall. Okay, good. Nice. I want. Yeah. Nice. 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 Switch. I wasn't really thinking about it a lot. Okay. <laughs> Doing it for better or worse. That's good though, because that's, that's, that's what you want. See what I did to his body? Yep. Yeah. Muscle up. So you all are being, you, you, guys, are, you guys are being nice. Chris, I'll be here. Oh. So that's what's going to happen. So there's a couple things you will. <laughs> There's a couple things you're, you're looking at too. Is you're, you're distancing on the when you go to dough. Okay. Okay. I yeah. want the sweet part of. It. Oh, yeah. I want the sweet part of. The <laughs> sweet part of the <laughs> I don't want this. This is nothing. Yeah. No, <laughs> yeah. When that end hit, when he first did it, that knocked the wind out of me. That actually knocked the wind out of me that first time he did it. Boom. That's why I lifted me off the ground too. So then from here, when you rotate, there's all kinds of options. You can go center mass. And push him backwards, pull him out, and then walk. <laughs> or you can go between the legs down here. You have all kinds of options at that point. But if you're in here, I'm checked. I got that. I got this. But now I'm using a little piece of the stick, mm -hmm. and hopefully some leverage, and hopefully something else. But I don't really have any options because he's going to. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that distance. Distance he's got. Even if I screw it up when he starts to cut upward or something, <laughs> right? I got cut in the back of the hand or whatever, but it's really weak. I'm in a better position. Yeah. Okay, one more time. Better, yeah. yeah. That was good. Nice. Yeah. One more time, Mike. <laughs> so this time you're going to do the same thing, Daniel and Mike, okay? So this time you're going to do the same thing, only instead of going to this cue show, we're going to step to the outside and drop this on this part of the hand, straight down over. And from there, straight up to the face. Okay? So, one more time. Boom. Oh, sorry. Hey, that's all we're using the pad stick. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. You're trying to hit Kasumi. 
Lord of the Bridge of the Nose. Okay, if he's a gigantic temple. guy like you me, you want to hit the bridge of the temple. You want to hit the temple. Kasumi is there. So if you can't hit Kasumi, anything on the face would be sufficient. Shocking. It's quick. It's shocking. Um, and you're targeting on the hand here is right here, this knuckle. Okay, sometimes you'll hit up here on the forearm area, but you really want to hit someplace on the hand. Because he probably will drop the weapon. One more time. Should I be wearing knuckles? No, I won't hit you again. <laughs> Off. Down. It's a full body down. Boom. Grab. Strap. Okay. Play with that. Take a bite of an eyeball, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You good? Yeah. Right. Yeah. right. Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah. Half an inch lower would have been. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> What's nice about this? You can use it when you're 80 years old. Really? No the same with, thing. Even with the cane. Yeah. Exact same movement. Drop your weight. And open your hips. Open your hips. How? Yeah. 